Hey, I'm Josh. I'm back for another vlog. Today I'm going to take you around some of the building sites we're going to be working on this year. There's a lot happening. It's really exciting. If you haven't already, go ahead and click subscribe and let's head to site. Day one of a brand new job. Beautiful views out there over the inlet and you can see the ocean and Mana Island right behind us. So it's going to be a mint spot. We're subdividing a rear property and building a brand new house on someone's backyard. It's going to be a seven to nine month process. And so I've got another Bruno camera and we're going to set this up and we're going to do another time lapse. <laughs> probably already see this one here is slightly different to the last two Bruno cameras I've reviewed. This is the BCC 200. Slightly better video quality from what I understand than the green one that I've been using. The green one's been awesome actually and for price versus what you get it's it's been amazing and produced some cool time lapses. Uh, that's predominantly what I use for this 4000 hour video here. But I'm going to give these ones a whirl and we will get this one set up just in the corner of the house looking down over the site. Let's get it set up. The thing I was just thinking is we'll come back here in a day or two and we'll pull the data off the card and just check that it's actually capturing what we want it to capture and there's no adjustments we need to make. There'd be nothing worse than like leaving this here for the next six months thinking that I'm getting amazing footage and I've just got like, I've, I've skipped the entire building site. So we've just popped over the hill to Whiteman's Valley. One of the builds we're going to kick off in a few weeks is a big 265 square metre home. This one's going to be really cool. There's going to be um, the main house, a big garage in the middle, and then the parents are going to build a little house off to the side. So we're doing two generations in one house. Right now that's being drawn up and will get submitted to council. So no doubt you will see that house sooner rather than later. And now let's head up into the Akatara Valley. Just up the road, we're building three homes. It's one of our bigger projects this year. Three homes for three separate people, all side by side, uh, set in a beach forest, really nice setting. Let's go and have a look at the sections. Yo, we've just pulled up to the sections. There's two behind you and one over here. Let me show you around. This one here is a really nice long section and beautiful outlook onto the forest. Capturing amazing sun right now. Sun's just over there, we'll sit over there. So on here, we're gonna do a big double garage over there and a long house. We can pull up a render of that house now. Great outlook, we've managed to protect some of the native trees out here and incorporate them into the build. This house here is gonna be for my friends, Luke and Joni. Luke designs most of my houses that I build and this will also be his house. Standing on the section next door and behind me is gonna be a 185 square meter four bedroom home. Uh, double garage will be over there and this house is going to be really cool It's going to be like an H and there'll be the living on that side there the garage and bedrooms there with a little annex between the two again amazing outlook uh, with these trees beautiful Sun really private uh, This is going to be an amazing spot to build a home
So each one of these sections is just over a hectare. And so my clients not only own a nice big flat building platform here, but they have all of this awesome natural bush that they will be able to explore. Great for young boys building forts, having fun. Uh, so this is the last section behind us. It's kind of like a triangle when you look at it on the map. They own a ton of this forestry here, but the build platform is long and skinny. Where we're standing right now will be the outdoor yard. They will have a covered patio area here. Kitchen lounge dining will be just there, and then the bedrooms go that way with the double garage on the end. We've incorporated a gym into the garage, so the garage will be nine meters deep six meters wide and there'll be a little 18 square meter area that will be carpeted and have its own sliding door off the back of the garage for an indoor gym. Got some really cool features in this house as well, cathedral ceiling in the lounge, lots of skylights, lots of cool stuff happening and one of the things I really like about this site is the views of Mount Climby in the background. Beautiful outlook on the hills and when we remove a few more of these pine trees over here, you're gonna have amazing all day sun. Really good section, really cool home getting built here as well. That's the tour of what we've got coming up this year. You know, last year you saw me build this house on the section that nobody wanted. Since then, I've launched J&K Building Co and we now have a bunch of houses to build in front of us this year. I want to take you, the viewer, along for the journey. And so we really want to up the ante on video quality. I'm aiming to produce one building vlog each week for the entire year. This is number one. We're going to take you along on the journey of building not only these homes, but the other ones you saw in the other areas of Wellington. As always, thanks for watching. If you haven't already, go ahead, click subscribe, and I'll catch you on the next building-related vlog.